Hello, I'm Campbell Ellis. The indigenous flowers of Southern California are a continuous source of inspiration to me and my family. Whether it's the petunia, the geranium, or the common daylily, the flowers of Southern California provide year-round enjoyment to all who witness their beauty. Just smell how fragrant these flowers are. Flowers delight me, be they the seaside daisy or the periwinkle. Flowers protect me. They provide a protective ring around me, this bathtub, my family, and finally my home. Excuse me for a second. Sign here for me. Uh, can you wait in the living room for a second? <laughs> Flowers bowl me over. Be they the snow poppy, the dahlia, or the spotted nettle. The indigenous flowers of Southern California have a deep metaphysical pull on me. And it gets to a point where I can't fight it anymore. And then maybe the flowers have won. And I must fight for the flowers. Hey man, you need to sign for these. Hey, don't be a dick. I'm talking to people about flowers. I'm not being a dick. Two minutes. You must think I'm a real asshole, right? Just sitting here in this tub, all for the flowers. I told you I had a family. I lied. My family's gone. It's just me and the flowers. The indigenous flowers of Southern California. Should I just leave? What's up, man? I just have other deliveries to do. Do you even like flowers? Of course I do. Hello, I'm Campbell Ellis. And I'm Barry, and I'm soaking in this tub, and I drive a UPS truck, and I like to eat sandwiches on my breaks. The indigenous flowers of Southern California provide a constant source of wonder to me. Uh, sometimes I park my truck in Sherman Oaks and eat a sandwich. Be it yellow jasmine, or the slipper orchid. The indigenous flowers of Southern California are a source of mystery and delight to both an experienced horticulturalist like myself or an amateur nature lover like Barry here. Doesn't have to be a sandwich. Could be a taco. Excuse me for a second. Come on, Barry. Come back to me. I can't, Campbell. I'm sorry, I can't. Can I ask why not? Because you spend all of your time soaking in that bathtub surrounded by flowers. The indigenous flowers of Southern California. Barry, can you go wait in the tub for me for a second? You're my wife. I think I deserve a better explanation than that. You need professional help, Campbell. Let me help you find somebody. Can you wait in the living room for me for just one second? Campbell. It's just right there. Campbell! Be it the zinnia or the pussy paws, the flowers of Southern California. Campbell! Just 
stand in the tub with me. Please. Just one soak. I can't, Campbell. There's too many memories in there. It's just one soak. I don't... Sandwich? Thank you, Barry. Hello. I'm Campbell Ellis. And I'm Erica Ellis. And I'm Barry. And I drive a UPS truck. The indigenous flowers of Southern California are a continuous source of merriment and satisfaction for me and my wife. Flowers are a delight. Whether it be the mountain lilac or the bush poppy, flowers bring life to any home. This bathroom smells great. Thank you, Barry. You know, there was a time in my life when it was just me in this bathtub. And bathtubs can be a very lonely place, even with all these flowers. The flowers of Southern California. This is a pretty big bathtub. How much would one of these cost, would you say? I don't know, Barry. Probably a bundle. I'm sorry, Campbell. I'm sorry I left you in this tub to soak and talk about flowers. The flowers of California. It's okay. I had the marigold and the desert primrose. Say, how much is, is a tub like this worth? I don't know. You don't know? You don't know because you're so goddamn rich? Yeah, that's it. That's it. Hello. I'm Campbell Ellis. And I'm Erica Ellis. I'm Officer Bruce McAllister of the LAPD. And I'm Officer Rachel Corman, also of the LAPD. I'm Barry. You know, the indigenous flowers of Southern California are a source of magic and mystery to all of us in this tub. I don't care if it's irises or honeysuckles. Flowers are a treasure. It's as plain and simple as that. Too, Becky. My little Sam. You know, I think everyone in this tub can agree that the family is a foundational social unit. There was a very dark time in my life not too long ago where there was no Barry, or Officer Bruce, or Officer Rachel. Of course, my wife and kids had left me, and I was all alone with these flowers, the indigenous flowers of Southern California. But things have turned around, and I have a funny feeling that things are gonna be all right for us. Everything is going to be all right for us. Hey, <laughs> man.